Here at the beginning of this video, I am not using any highlighter around my mouse. That's because I want to show you how it works from the beginning. If you're a presenter and you want your audience to follow along as you move your mouse on your screen, it's simple. Go to the description of the video and use the link there and that link will land you on this page. And here on this page, find your way to paying attention v11.exe. So click on the exe file to download it. And be sure of the folder you are downloading into. For me, it's in my downloads folder. Save. And the download is done here. Open the folder where you've downloaded it in and you see the setup file. Double click on it or your right mouse click and select open. It will request your administrative permission. Give it a yes. And from there you proceed to next. Next again. Successfully installed. Finish. Then the next thing you will need to do is go to your Windows Start button and search for Pen Attention. Then you go to the app, Pen Attention 11 app, and it should pop up on your screen. And if you don't see it, don't worry. Come down here to your tray icon and you see it right here. Click on it here and you have the settings pop up here. Go to Highlight Settings. In the highlight settings, the first thing to do is to come to this button here that says highlight mouse as well as pen. You need to turn it on. Check the box. Boom, now we have the highlighter around the mouse cursor to change the shape, the size, and the color. Take note, whatever changes we make here, we'll see it in the preview section this way here. Now to start with the shape, here it's on circle. Now I can change it to rectangle and you can see it in the preview there. I can as well make adjustment to the size. Here is the height and here is the width. Just play around it the way you want it. If you're good and fine, you can just leave it like that. And you can as well change to circle if you, that's your choice. And play around this handle here to drag the size of your radius here as well. Now I'm sure you don't want black as your highlighter. To change the color, come here, click in color and pick any of this basic color here as your choice. I pick yellow. What if the color you want is not in the basic colors? Then you come down here, define custom colors, click in it and select any color region of your choice. When you pick any region, change the shade of the color you want down here by dragging this handle up and down. Whenever you're good and fine, remember to click OK here. But for me, I don't want this. I'll be going back to my yellow and I give it OK. And that's it there in the preview and the opacity as well. If I set it to 100, now you cannot see through the highlighter or see anything behind the highlighter. And I'm sure you don't want that. So the best is to give it around between 35 to 40. That looks okay. And for me, I go with rectangle. Perfect for me. And I come down here, apply changes. Now I have it the way I want it. Close. What if I don't want to use the highlighter on my mouse for a certain reason for a particular period of time and turn it on later when I need it. How do I do that? Come down here to the tray icon and you see the pen attention 11 app here. When you click on it, then you go to highlight pen or mouse. When I click on that, now it's gone. I can use my mouse without any highlighter around it. And what if I want it back on? Just click on it, pen attention 11, highlight pen or mouse again. Now it's back. So it's easy to toggle on and off by the time you just use this here. What if a case you don't have these here? You can just always come to your window start and search for pen attention app. Click on it. Then you should have it display right here. If you don't have it, of course, you can always find it in the tray icon. Subscribing to this channel is good for you and me. Therefore, subscribe here and like this video by giving it a thumbs up so you can see my other videos. Thank you for watching.